Hey friends, hey, it's your girl Kitty. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are a ride or die part of KKC, welcome back. Today guys, I'm having honey garlic ribs, barbecue ribs, it's just the barbecue sauce, it's chicken and rib flavor, and one and a half baked potatoes because they were just, they're small. So I was like, I want more. <laughs> Anyways, let's dig in. Let's dig in, folks. Let's get some potato and cheese. I don't know if I can. Mm -hmm. You guys can have the first bite. Yum. So. I've been kind of MIA for a little bit. I've been sick. I'm just drinking bubbly. Let's take in these ribs. You guys can have the first bite. There's oh, steam rolling off it. Mm. So juicy. <laughs> so I was sick for like four weeks. Mm-hmm. In bed. Then I ended up going to the hospital. Oreo, get out of the garbage. The the first week, I uh, it was just like basic cold symptoms, <coughs> and then. All of a sudden, week two. It was weird. One day I felt sick, the next day I was all right. So I thought I was getting better. Mm. Then week three hit me. Like a train. So I was like, all right, or you don't get in the stop it. Part of this story coming up is going to be TMI, but. Get out of it. So I was really sick. John wasn't feeling well. So I'm like, all right, it'll take forever to get in to see my family doctor. So I'm like, I'll just go to the, they have like a morning, like a, um, a clinic, walk-in clinic. As long as you have your Medicare, you can be, be seen or I think they if you don't have Medicare they just charge you I don't know I don't know how it works so so my dad was gonna go and put our name on the list to be seen at the clinic well, the next morning, we're supposed to go to the clinic. So I wake up and I go to the washroom. This is the TMI part. I apologize, but it is what it is. And um, so anyways, I go to the washroom and I pee. 
and I'm like, I turn around and I know like, I don't, I know this is like gross, but I'm sure I'm not the only human being that does this. When you use the washroom, do you look at your pee? Do you look at your stool? Whatever. Well, I'm one of those people that does. Anyways, and it was like fruit punch in the toilet, basically. I know, TMI, but it is what it is. And that scared the living daylights out of me. So I wake Jamie up and I'm like, you need to take me to the hospital. Oreo, please stop. So we get ready. He drives me to the hospital. I call my mom. She's like, okay, I'll, you know, I'll get up and get ready. Because Jamie had to drop John off there. So I go to the hospital. It really didn't take me long to be seen. They did chest x-rays. It didn't take me long to be seen at all. They took me right back and put me in a room in a hospital bed in the ER and put me on a, a aerosol mask. What a difference. Oh, I should have brought a knife. So just, just so you know that, that TMI was the only TMI part. Um, so They put me on the aerosol. What a difference. Oops. That helped so much. I could actually take a like full breath. Like fill my lungs with oxygen. Because before. I couldn't. I couldn't take a full breath. And. Um, so they did x-rays. Drew blood. Checked my my urine sample and everything came back fine except for my lungs. They saw like a spot. And they said it um that it was pneumonia. Mm. And the way the doc the way the doctor told me scared the living daylights out of me. He's like, Yeah, so we we seen a spot on your lung. So of course my I just went in like what? I went into like panic mode. Like, what do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> you see a spot on my lungs. And he's like, yeah, you're probably right. It's, it's pneumonia. I was kind of like, either you're a dummy. <laughs> Or you just have no clue how to talk to a patient and explain, like, how to explain it to them. What's wrong? Don't just say, yeah, I think you were right. Anyways. All right, dude. So he prescribes me, I don't even know. Oh, um, amoxicillin. And I'm thinking... You're telling me I have pneumonia and you're giving me amoxicillin? Like, I've been given amoxicillin when I've just had, like, bronchitis and stuff like that. So I was like, all right. Like, he's the doctor, right? So I left there. I was about half, 
almost halfway through my prescription, my family doctor calls and says, Hi, Brenda. This is so-and-so calling from so-and-so's office. Um, he wants to see you. Can you come in right now? I freaking lost my shit. I lost my shit. I was f crying. You know, instantly my my mind went to worst case scenario. Oreo, stop. So anyways... My dad's like, I'm on my way. I'll be right there. He came and got me. Took me to my doctor's office. Get out of it, Oreo. All he wanted was to switch my prescription. And I know, like, they don't... They're not going to say anything over the phone whether it's good or bad news they're just going to call you into the, their office but anyway so i went in he switched my prescription gave me something stronger the pre uh, prescription i was on was amoxicillin it was like um two pills three times a day and or no was it one pill three times a day or th two pills three times? i don't know anyways regardless So he gave me something stronger. I can't even pronounce this stuff. And they said the spot was on my left lung. And that's where all the pain was. Like when to breathe in, it hurt. I had pain coming up into my shoulder. And I like, seriously guys, anything to do with respiratory, don't mess around. Go see a doctor. But, yeah, I was like, I think day, day two of, of those, the new prescription, I was really starting to feel better. Mm. Guys, I'm almost, but yeah, that's my story. Um... Of where I've been, what's going on? I'm almost done. Yes, I'm switching subjects. I'm almost done breaking bad, guys. Such a good show. I'm almost done, though. These ribs seem tougher than the last ones I had. Give me that barbecue sauce. <sighs> so. That's where I've been and that's what's up. I had all these plans for my thousand subscriber video I was going to do. I'm still going to do it. But, woo! But I have to, uh... I have to reschedule everything. because I've been sick so I haven't I haven't been able to do anything so yeah tell me in the comments down below what's new with everybody what's going on
try these honey garlic ones the barbecue ones were good yum the honey garlic ones are juicier Because they were like submerged in the honey garlic sauce. Well guys. Thank you for having dinner with me. Um, yeah, I just wanted to catch you guys up with what's been going on where I've been I've been trying <laughs> I've been trying to post content I was lucky that I had a couple of videos I could put up uh, the video I posted of John and the other bandmates from around the city um, grade 6 to 12 I think in the video I said 7 to 12 but it's grade 6 to 12 and that wasn't all of the students from band that's just the ones that showed up for this it was open to all band members from every school across my city. But whatever kids could make it or show up or had a way there were welcome to to go and learn this the Jurassic Park theme song. And but yeah, um that video I think got flagged like copyright, but it said that I was allowed to leave it up. So um also update on my channel um, I opted to make my channel that is it's not for kids because there is times I talk about things and I cuss every now and again and um, I just would really prefer my audience to be adult so anyways guys I love you so very much again if you're new and you made it this far what are you waiting for? Join the KKC family, hit that subscribe button, and yeah, I love you guys, and I will see you in my next one. Deuces!